we're uh, demonstrating our window energy profiler um, that we've had out for, uh, for a short while. Uh, basically, it has the capability of analyzing windows and showing the energy performance of the windows. Uh, used as a, a, a tool to be able to identify coating uh, and the performance of windows, showing ultraviolet energy transmission, uh, visible light uh, transmission or tint, and uh, even estimating the solar heat gain coefficient values of the windows. So it's a, a very great piece for educating a customer, perhaps, on their purchasing decision uh, regarding a window, um, and also to show kind of a before and after, maybe here's where your window was, and then uh, jumping to a uh, higher performing coating, uh, you can educate them on the benefits and actually bring the energy performance of the window to life so they can actually see the difference. Uh, rather than just going to a data sheet and saying it's going to be better, you can actually take this tool in the field and uh, be able to help educate the customer on the benefits. Uh, the other application that's great is identifying the different types of coating. Uh, if there's applications where you're not sure, uh, perhaps if you have the right coating installed, occasionally mix-ups do happen, and uh, this allows you to go out and instantly know uh, by its performance you can identify each coating uh, individually. Uh, new this year is our Glass Check Pro for uh, measuring uh, glass and airspace thickness of windows. Uh, it gives you the readouts either in uh, millimeters or in inches, uh, showing you the glass uh, and airspace thickness and the total overall thickness of the window. Uh, and then it also tells you the location of the low E coatings in the window and the type of low E coating, which has been a huge selling point for this product. Uh, it allows you to identify if it's a soft coat or a hard coat low E. Uh, and if it is a soft coat low E, it even has the ability to split out and tell you what type of soft coat by the number of silver layers that were laid down on the low E coating to make that coating.